Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 2 Part 73. And in this segment, I'm gonna buy a car. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna buy a Ferrari. Which Ferrari? This Ferrari. No. It's going to be this Ferrari, the F50. So. Yay! Ferrari F50! For a quarter of a million. Because why not? So, there we go. We got us a Ferrari F50. We're going to take it to our final rivalry face off. It is the Pride of Italy. Or the Orgo. Or fuck. Orgo Glio d'Italia. Pretty sure I just horribly butchered that. Absolutely horribly. Anyways, this is limited to 12 cylinder Ferraris and Lambos and. Yeah. So, me and Muller are going to be tag teaming this shit, except no fuck you, Muller. So, yeah. Anyways. Five races. The only five race, uh. Pretty sure it's the only five race thing. Yeah, it's the only five race, uh. Face off, whatever the fuck this is. Anyways. So, Silverstone, Sunset Peninsula, Maple Valley Reverse, Lunaseka, Magello. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Let's get started with this bitch starting second. Because I'm better than, um. Muller, that's his name. So off we go. I know, this is how you guys work. So, can I beat the statistically superior Enzo Ferrari? That happens to be the massive understeer machine. Will Rossi have to struggle with the massive understeer machine like I did? We shall find out. Also, seeing me uh, driving this F50 makes me wonder, hmm, test drive. You used the F50 GT for this, didn't you? I just have a feeling. Okay, yeah. Ross is gonna be right on my ass. Like, right on my ass. Did use the F50. Knew it. Or the F50 GT. Oh, wing mirrors clipped. Oh, please, car, slow down. Holy shit. I'm not driving this car very well right now. In base for his car is god tier. I don't know about that, Q. I don't have a 20 second lead already. So, you know. Oh, fuck. How you doing, Mr. Dive Man? Alright. As if we needed confirmation test drive. I know you used the 50 GT, damn it. It's like an hour, two minutes. I guarantee it's going to take me longer than an hour, two minutes. Considering, you know, I'm driving the uh, inferior version of the F50. Also much worse. I'm having a lot of issues here, I don't know why. Guess what Q said, please. 
I know we like to have a meme and fun time here, but goddamn. Sometimes there's too much. When you know Q is, like, telling people to calm the fuck down, that's when you know you fucked up, because Q is a giant memer himself. So, you know. Yeah. This has been your PSA for today. Meanwhile, um, we've driven the fuck away from Muller. Hey, Ad, yo. Welcome to Ferrari Town. Also, there may be a couple Lambos in in this town, but they, they don't matter. Yeah, so GT Sport. I am hype. Rossi is indeed riding the booty. Maybe not so much right now, but he will be in a, like around this after this section because I fucking royally suck at this section. Give me some of your spaghetti pie or whatever. Test drive. I want some. Give me. Sorry, grid playthrough, grid series playthrough last night. Ooh, noise. No, my Spoger. Give me some of your goddamn Spoger. Motherfucker. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, Grid 1 is a fucking amazing game. It's so much fun. I mean, it technically is the seventh game of the Toka series, so you know. Stuff. And then Grid 2 happened, and it was still a good game. Didn't did not leave me to <laughs> did not meet the expectations at all but it was still a good game and then grid autosport happened and it was like oh hey this is what grid 2 should have been and it's a great game like like I'm not going to say that grid 2 is bad in any way cuz it's not a bad game at all. It's still a good game, it's just not what we were expecting. And stuff. <clears throat> and the campaign is short as fuck. Like, it took me, like, what, 12 hours to complete it? Okay, four down, three to go. So, seven laps around Silverstone. Long race, bro! Masters isn't good with sequels. Meanwhile, Colin McRae 2. Uh, Toka 2. Toka Race Driver 2. Dirt 2. 
even though I prefer Dirt 1. Uh, you know. Uh, what was the other two? I don't remember. RC2, best car game ever. But it's not a true rally game, therefore it's the worst rally game ever to exist. Come on. Ridge Racer 7. It's Craigasm. I still need to play Ridge Racer 6 and 7. Yes, I'm playing 6 and 7, I know. 7 is just like 6, but more just to get 7. Fucking, I'm getting 6 and 7, I'm playing them both. Fuck off. Okay, see you later. I also need to get the two PSP Ridge Racers. I like have an ISO of the first one, but I want an actual UMD of it. Cause yeah. Oh, stay out of the grass. Just trying to scratch my itchy ass fucking nose. And we're playing oh god, Pro Street and Shift on a keyboard. Let's see what epic racing game that I try playing with a keyboard. I know I used to play Sports Car GT with a keyboard. That was no bueno. Also, um, I did play through... I did do my DTR play, th like, LP on, with a keyboard. And I'll probably do DTR sprint cars with keyboard as well. <clears throat> so, yeah. About that. <coughs> Sneezing. Rossi right on my ass. Because I took that turn way fucking wide. I thought there was another big racing game that I used to, like, that I tried playing with the keyboard. I don't remember. I don't remember. Paradise 2 with keyboard. Too easy. Yeah, man. God, remember when I tried to play Burnout Paradise 2 with a fucking wheel? That was awful. I, I, I'm sticking with a goddamn controller for arcade games. That's for goddamn sure. Hey, final lap. Oh god. Whoa. I'm glad I didn't get dicked by sticky grass there. I'm really glad I didn't get dicked by sticky grass. Oh, hello Rossi. You dove lower than I was expecting. I'm like, all right, let's do a somewhat defensive line here, and he fucking went lower. Wait. You're not getting me this time, Rossi. I know that game. I'll defend as much as I have to. I kind of fucked that up. So I really want to know my tire wear here. Thirty-three percent. Okay. 
It's around 30%. It's actually less than I was expecting. I was expecting at least 40. But hey, that works. So hooray, I won. And got the best slap over Rossi. Ha ha, owned. I'm better than you, Imrossi. Meanwhile, waiting on everybody else, because, uh... A-class cars, they're underpowered. So... Hooray. Hurry up, Garcia and Johansson. Holy shit. Why do you gotta be so slow? Okay, there. Uh, excuse me, yawning. They has finished. I got a double level up on my Ferrari. Nice. Sweet. Fucking Ferrari exclusive discounts. Nice. Okay, time for race two. At the peninsula. It had to be saying. Why? I don't know. So, eight laps around the peninsula. We go. Oh, I was actually expecting Rossi to uh, hit the brakes there, but nope. He did not. It's okay, I got the. Oh, hell. Oh, yeah, that's right, mid engine. Thanks, Rossi. Thank you. Well, shit. It also somehow did a lot of clutch damage. Like, alright, let's see what happened here with that. That wasn't even like a big hit, but damaged my engine, damaged my clutch, and damaged my left rear suspension. Holy shit. Fucking Rossi with the AI vengeance. God damn. And then Miller got ahead of Rossi. Nice. Let's see who's better. Uh, undamaged for our F50 versus uh, Smokescreen F50. Rossi's out for booty. Well, he got my booty. Alright, this is where I get a good uh, reading on how fucked I am. Pretty fucked, I have to say. Pretty fucked. But, I still might be able to win this race, to be perfectly honest. Gotta keep blinding them with my smoke screen. So it totally affects them. Except it doesn't. Oh shit. No, Rossi's not in black. He's driving the Enzo. Muller's driving the uh the black car, the black F fifty. Oh fuck. I should stop, um, cutting the course. So, how much power am I getting now? Four hundred thirteen horsepower. Damn. Four hundred thirteen horsepower. I'm still doing better than them. Oh uh, yeah, Q. Speaking of Isaac, how has uh, the Isaac thing been going?
I like how this is like a, a possible victory. Oh, I hadn't been playing it. Oh, what the frick, Q? How dare you? I don't know. Kids in my room do this, then doze off on YouTube. Fucking Q living the dream here. We still have a half second wheel. Hey, Ross, he got second back. And also pulled the fuck away from more. Well, I just outbroke myself. Go me. Hello, Rossi. first gear there. Yeah, Rossi isn't dominating because he sucks ass. Although... Yeah, you slow away the fuck down, bro. I was really hoping more uh, would smash to the back of him and damage his engine. But I don't think that happened. I love that smoke screen. Oh, oh Rossi led that lap. Damn. Oh, okay. I baited him, though. He fucking put the anchor down big time for the kink. Get fucking baited, son. Baited like the new Ghostbusters. <laughs> I'm not bringing that discussion into this chat. Don't even start. Master Vader. <laughs> this is the Vape Nation Ferrari. Except, um, they painted it the wrong color. I still need to get it painted green. trying to outside move. Nope. Uh, I do not remember that actually, K-Boys, about the fucking mystery cards against humanity guy. I ain't to know what you're talking about. Unless that was secretly me. The one time I was like, eh, eh, I'm actually playing, haha. -ha. But I don't think that was me. Because I'm pretty sure I would have set my, I'd set my name something more retarded than ma just Master Bater.
Still love how I'm actually winning this race. Oh, grass, no bad, 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 bad. I swung a little too much there. A little too much of an arc. And suddenly, I have a huge gap over Muller and Rossi. What happened to those two? Are they doing a little argy bargy? Oh, yeah, that was fucking M25 when I played. That's right. That was during the whole uh, Arthur Vine meme craze. That Phil and Rossi can't pass Muller as he passes Muller. Oops. close Rossi's going to get here and if I can bait him again. I have a feeling that like he might be in within baiting range. Or he could go see the outside. That works too. Whatever floats your boat. I remember my inspiration for uh, doing LPs. It was the worst inspiration, like least inspiring person you could probably think of. No, not DSP. No, not Slap Train. God. No, Rossi. You're staying behind me. No, I was not inspired by Game Grumps. I fucking started LPing long before Game Grumps was a thing. I, st I started LPing before Ego Raptor even tweeted. Made the tweet saying uh, he was going to kill himself if he ever did an LP. Or someone would kill him. Someone kill him if he ever did an LP. You know, my inspiration was fucking Rigno. You know, if, if you know who Red Supre is, I'm sure sure you've seen that video. Those uh, RPs. Oh my God! Okay, Rossi with a very sudden fucking move. I was not expecting that. Oh man. Okay. Well, um, that was a finish, and now the AI is confused. AI is very confused. It's just crashing into the wall over... Oh, oh! There he goes. Alright. I sound different in my early LPs because I had a really, really bad microphone then. Like, a really bad one. Also, I was really, really nervous. Really nervous. So, there we go. Um, that was a weird race, too. That I had no business winning, but there we go. There we go. So, to race uh, three. Alright, so, here we go. Time for race number three. Maple Valley Reverse. 
This one should be okay, pending any uh, shenanigans with getting around Rossi. So, off we go. I know what spot I'll probably end up passing him at, it's just a matter of can I make it a clean pass, aka not fuck up my car. Okay, this is not the spot I was thinking of, but this'll work, I guess. Oops, and I forced Rossi wide. And into the wall. That is not how that was supposed to go down. I was expecting to pass him, like, right around here. But, um... Well... That didn't exactly ha- Esposito is in second, what the fuck? Excuse me. He's driving the Diablo. GTR. Oh god. Why am I taking horrible lines here? I need to stop taking bad lines through these turns. I have a feeling Rossi isn't going to be, uh, be very cooperative with me next time we race. He, he gonna be angry. At least if this game had like a rival system like the NASCAR 2004 or 5 or 6, blah, 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 blah. you know. Yeah, Diablo GTR. It's called GTR in this game. Not GT2. <laughs> like the Win Holocaust GTR, yes, that. Exactly that. Esposito is still in second. Oops, what am I doing? NASCAR Thunder Series has it. I know 2004 has it. I don't think any of the earlier Thunder games has a, like a rival system. Like, I think it started in 2004 and then 05 and 06 and possibly 07 had it. Hey, Rossi's recovered to fourth. Nice. I think it's only a matter of time before he gets back up to second, to be honest. The rival system was very, uh, hit and miss, because... Um, fucking, like, if they do something to you, they'll get pissed off at you, so that was a major flaw in the system. Thought that was, no, 2002 didn't have it, 2003 doesn't have it either. Also, I did what I accidentally did to Rossi. Eh? Oh yeah, they'll fucking try to take you out no matter what happens if they're pissed off at you. Talk about racing for the lead. Lap one. You know, fuck it, I'm swerving left into you, motherfucker. Also, hooray, another easy Maple Valley race. Well, hey, Rossi made it up to second already. And Esposito got shuffled back to fourth. Oops. He was just holding the spot for Rossi, you know. Oh, 
happens if you piss everyone off in NASCAR games. Um, good fucking luck, kid. That's all I have to say. Either you want to be way ahead or way the fuck behind. Fifty me love, yeah. F fifty awesome car shit. Although I prefer the F forty. Not entirely sure why, I just do. I, I legit like don't know why I prefer the F forty. Also, I think Rossi is a uh, faster than me right right mile. May have to deal with him for the end of the race. Or not. So I only just gained a hundred meters on him, alright. Works for me, I guess. Fuck. My opinion on the whole Kenseth Logano thing, um... They need to let bygones be bygones, for fuck's sake. Also, oh no, the media's also, it's fucking gold for the media, because, you know, how much they love drama and uh, making it seem like much a far, far bigger deal than it actually is. So, you know, that. Honestly, I don't give a shit. I really don't. It's like, yeah, there are a couple pissed off drivers. Okay, I came to see racing. <laughs> I'm not all about that drama shit. Also, I know a lot of people hate Joey Logano, but I am still a Logano fan. Yes, he is kind of a whiny douchebag at times, but I still like Logano. I like both of the Penske drivers. I realize their faults as people, but I, I still like them. Anyway, it's two to go at uh, Maple Valley, and I'm Hold the fuck away from Rossi, so much for him being faster than me. I fucking... I heard that. I think I heard that, Harry. Fucking WWE fans gonna go home happy after the Martinsville thing. I guess I'm just a special, as in special ed, <laughs> breed. When it comes to uh, opinions on racing and what is like good racing for me. At this point, we could have a fucking drama alert of Rhino GT4 versus every fucking piece of media in the world. Cause, oh no, I don't give a shit about drama. I like fun. I like watching cars go fast, not uh, fucking smash into pieces. I know, I'm a fucking idiot and don't, uh have the true essence of a real race fan. But, eh. I watch 
racing for the racing. And I've said this time and time again, if you watch racing solely to watch for the crashes... No. Please tie a noose. Just, just get out. Yeah, I like watching cars go fast and, like, dice for position. I don't like watching cars go fast in a fucking... ...line. I don't like the plate races. Actually, the biggest reason why I don't like Daytona and Talladega is because the old, you know, the big one. There's always the crash that takes out like 20 cars at least. And I hate that. It's like, wow. This sure is great. Look at all these cars that can't fucking win now. Woo. Ooh. Anyways, I win this race. F50 too strong. So, hooray! God damn, I won by 12 seconds overall. Well, actually 11 and a half, but still. I beat Rossi by a lot. Oh hey, Esposito said his best lap in the last lap. Nice. Nice, I say. Anybody else gonna do the same thing? We'll find out in 200 years. Once Martin Garcia and Johansson eventually cross the line. Big ones are exciting. No. I don't like when it happens. It's like, oh hey, someone made the tiniest fucking error. Wow. And now fucking 20 cars. Uh, pay for it. No. I hate that. It's stupid. It really is stupid. Anyways, let's go to race four. Okay. Well, race four attempt two. Because, um, I got dumped into the corkscrew by Rossi. Eh? I should, uh, remember that. So. Remember when I said Rossi was going to get his revenge on me after, uh, the uh, Sunset Peninsula finish and also the beginning of the Maple Valley race? He sure just did. So I believe we're almost even. So, once I get in front of Ross, I have to be very careful uh, getting on the binders for the corkscrew as far as where my car is. So that doesn't happen. So yeah, Rossi got his revenge takedown. Because burnout references. Up the Ray Hall straight. You know, Mr. Lossy. No, the AI isn't passive aggressive like that. It's just I broke a lot earlier than Rossi into the corkscrew queue. And, uh, he had nowhere to go. That's all that happens. I'm just playing it up for the sake of the LP. I'm creating my own shitty media drama. I don't even know. Also, I didn't do my turn 11 dive this time. Whoops. I should have drive club A. I was like that. Oh, God. Pretty sure you'd be worse off, Q. Much worse off. <laughs> be getting owned every race, I know, right? Don't worry, I'd be getting owned every race either, or as well, because I'm fucking terrible at uh, clean overtakes.
fucking right on his bumper. Around the corkscrew. I'll oh, fuck that up. See if I can get a good run through turn 10, set up a dive in turn 11. Yeah, that was a decent run. We dive. I'm just barely pinch him off. Oh, okay, never mind. Ross ain't having that shit. Yeah, I know, Q. I, I, I saw you. Oh, okay. I was waiting for that to happen. But yeah, I saw you play Drive Club. I know. AI takes those turns insanely slow. Kind of like how they do around certain turns in this game. And shit like that happens. Fuck me. Which makes clean overtakes difficult. It's okay, Q. I know what you mean. If, like, it was competent AI, clean overtakes would probably be, be easier. Yoink. Okay, now. See what happens here. Okay, no shenanigans this time into the corkscrew. At least don't have to worry about mechanical damage in Drive Club. I think. Hooray, we finished a third of the race. Confirmed 12 minute plus r race. Could be boring and turn damage off, but I'm not doing that. I ain't having that shit. Full everything all the way. Damage, difficulty, no assists. I'm God. No, no. Oh, something happened to Ross, eh? I just noticed he uh, fell to fourth. Yeah, I'm boring enough as is. Ah, uh, anyways. You were expecting me to say that, weren't you? Yeah, I wonder what happened to Rossi to make him fall to fourth. Nah, if Rossi had engine damage, he'd be Esposito would probably be pulling away from him. He definitely had some kind of off-track moment. Because he's right on Esposito's ass fucking right there. Shit posting LP a thing. Me. I don't know. I don't know what my shit posting would be. No. But yeah, pretty sure I didn't give Rossi any engine damage from that hit. Before Rossi somehow does put oh he'll get around Esposito. Trust me, he'll get around Esposito eventually. It's just a matter of when. Anyway, I got Muller trying to close the gap on me. Big slide around turn ten. It actually helped getting the car around the turn. Oh yeah, shitpost LP. Big rigs. <laughs> That's the ultimate shitpost. Therefore, Thunder has done a shitpost LP. Ah, anyways.
Yes, I was doing the real Dale Sr. to fast opposition. I was using my Intimidator trademark ability. Still love how EA fucking trademark Intimidator for the fucking uh, NASCAR games. Like, wow, alright. At least I'm pretty sure it was an e it's an EA trademark, considering. Oh god. Weird. Yeah, fucking Intimidator TM. Hey look, we're also got around Esposito. While I wasn't looking, what a shock. Like, the entire last lap, I was just staring at that. To see when Rossi was gonna get around him, then I look away. Hey look, he's in third place now. Three laps to go. I have a four second advantage over Moore. Now, will Ross be able to catch uh, Moore in these last three laps and make a bid for second place? That is the question. It's 300 meters behind right now. Actually, a lot more than that. A lot more than that. Uh-oh, Rossi has spaghetti again. He's gone off track. I think at turn four... Actually, no, it was probably turn three where he went off. So, yeah, I think, uh, I think Rossi just went off track at turn three there. Oh, fuck. Two to go. Well, it's probably a little closer this time. Yep, he gained second on me. I should step it up. Miller doesn't catch me. Yeah, Rossi fourth again. He went off track. He went wide on turn three. Last lap. Wow, Law and Order SVU. It's like they took every fucking shitty stereotype about gamers and put them in the episode. That stupid episode. Yeah, that was a horrible episode. Like I said, they picked the worst stereotypes. And now that's what I'm sure a lot of people think that uh, gamers truly are like. Because, ha <laughs> fuck me. Anyways. Also, the fucking, like... Just the, the gaming puns in that episode were so cringeworthingly bad. Ooh, he leveled up. Or they leveled up. It's like, wow, please stop. Please. Whoever writes this show needs to no, stop it. Like, I don't even give a shit about cop dramas, but like, oh god. It's so bad. So, so very bad. So 
I wonder what the hell caused Rossi to uh, go wide on turn 3 a couple laps ago. Because he was ahead of Esposito enough to where he didn't have to worry about that. He just outdrove himself, I don't know. Of course Quinn and Sarkeesian would like that episode because they are, like, you know, the two worst human beings on the planet. That's not even an exaggeration. And easy win. After, you know, Rossi's misfortunes. Hey, we got the F51 too, sweet. Oh, this is going to be another missed podium for Rossi, I just realized that. Heard about this Hey Kids channel and heard it's weird. Wait a minute. Isn't that the fucking Bradbury channel now? Pretty sure that's the Bradbury channel. Yeah, or else you did get a better lap than me. That bastard! It's okay, I won the race, that's all that matters. Yeah, Rossi is killed again for like the uh, ninth time. Something like that. Come on, Johansson, get your cunt ass across the line, thank you. Hey, no damage, sweet. Alright, so, I just, hey! <laughs> Max my car's level before the last race. Nice. Well, let's go through the last race. Okie dokie. Final race, Mugello. Let's do this. Let's do this. Oop. Haven't seen it, you should watch that video queue. Because it's uh, pretty interesting. Okay, I need to concentrate on this race here a little bit. So I actually, like, don't lose. My video's been re-uploaded on Facebook. I'm pretty sure SoFlo doesn't give a shit about fucking racing games, Harry. Nice meme. Anyway, let's just find a place to get around Rossi here. I'll get out of the grass. Do I go for a dive here? Nope. Hit the brakes at the exact same time. That was nice. Oh god, okay. So you must not pull away from me, goddammit. I shall not allow this. Slipstream to the heavens! Or not. Okay, um, I'm not liking this gap here. I'm not liking my driving right now either. Going for it. Nope. Got pinched.
Ah, it's trying so hard to get a run out of this turn, but I fucked it up. Dive! I was way late on the brakes there. Way late. Oh, hello, how you doing, Rossi? That was my fault for going super wide. God, that chicane sucks. It's got a titch ad for Forza NASCAR, nice. So why are you getting an ad now? Do you fucking refresh? Yeah, Lambos don't really stand a chance in this series. Ferrari too strong. I mean, I could have bought the Diablo GTR and, like, upgraded it, but I didn't feel like it. Oh, hello, how you doing? What's up, Mr. Rossi? And we're going wide, and over-under from Rossi, our wing mirrors clip into each other. Oh, he's still there. He's still there. I could have pinched him there, but nope. I had to refresh because buffering. Whoops. Got him. For now. It's so much red. So much Ferrari. Rossi making Thunder 2 level retan dives. Hey, as long as it's not Forza 1 level retan dives, those were the worst. Like, the AI in Forza 1, oh my god. Talk about fucking retard dives. Of course, my favorite thing about the Force 1 AI is when they dive on somebody around Tokyo into the hairpin and get stuck. It's like my favorite thing, because it's, it's just like, ha, huh, huh, ha, way to go, way to fucking go. Wait, they go fucking, like, under the... God, they go all the way down the apron to dive in O2? That's... Yeah, that's... That's, uh... That's beyond Forza 1 ridiculous. At least they stay, like... In Forza 1, they only go to the extreme inside. They don't, like, go off course. So, you know. Kind of holding off Rossi here, keeping him at bay. Got an, got an achievement for driving 50 miles in a Ganassi car, nice. Evan achievement. I wonder if there's an achievement like that for each of the uh, left turn teams that were added in with that expansion. But basically what you guys are saying is when I eventually LP the uh, NASCAR Thunder games in like 500 centuries, it's going to be quite the uh, holocaust with the AI. Well, 
there is. Um, great. Hooray for weird achievements. So not even weird achievements, but just interesting achievements. Eh, I was dank ahead of Rossi there, anyways. Hendrick, Haas, Chip, and Pinsky. So, four achievements for driving different fucking NASCARs 50 miles. Swag. Centuries for Thunder Games. I'm sorry, K Boys. You know how large my LP list is and how long these games are because racing games are fucking long, unless it's Ridge Racer 1 or 2. But seriously, these NASCAR, like, the NASCAR games with careers, those LPs are going to take for goddamn ever. Like, forever. Forever. Except maybe Thunder 2002 because of the whole lock to 5% race length thing. Also, there's a thing I wanted to do with Dirt Today Tone, but I don't know if I actually should. Hey, Corvette. I haven't seen you in a while. Yeah, 98 won't take long because it's just one season in like 17 races, something like that. Outbreaking myself. Oh, hello. Gotta get my engine drone fix, yeah. I have a feeling a lot of people won't enjoy listening to the uh, NASCAR 98 LP because just be a constant. Oh, fucking Rossi. Alright. I need to do a thing. I was not close enough to do the thing. Screw you. Dirty moves. Ooh, I forgot to fucking write down that I uh, had to restart it. For goodness sake, I should probably do that before I forget. <laughs> Come on, step it up. Okay, do not go wide for the love of fuck. <laughs> the drama. Watching that gap. Alright, you can't do anything with me. Yay, I won! Yay! I got an achiever. Not an Eddie achiever, but an achiever. So, there we go. The only five race rivalry face off. Complete. Now just wait on the A-class cars to finish. And now we wait. I did a thing. Congration! I win. And there we go. Everyone across the line, almost a minute behind me, is Johansson. So, not much repairs. Not bad. Only 60,000 credits away from level 50. Oh boy! We's getting close to the level cap. Getting very close to the level cap. So, yay, we've finished first in the pride of Italy. 
And for winning this uh, Ferrari versus Lamborghini championship, we get a Pagani. Because that makes sense. Oh well. It's a cool car. Wait, they had the position lights in fucking 2003? What the fuck? That is what that is next to the number plate, is the class position lights. Pretty sure it is. I didn't realize I did that way back in 2003. Damn. Anyways, we got us a Zonder race car. Cool. So there we go. Another event type completed. We're uh, getting down to the nitty gritty here. So, next time on Forza 2, we will go move on to the regional championships, but not finish it, because, yeah. So, stay tuned for that.